And to know from Manchester, it's an ideal day for football here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City up against Watford. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, the graphic tells you the full story. Manchester City with the best defence in the league. That's official. Well, they've been so solid at the back, whether it's in front of their own fans or away from home. I think it comes down to communication. They're just so well drilled and organised. Hopefully for the neutrals, they do concede the first one today. Great game. Thanks. Good game. Thanks. Cheers. Good luck. Thanks. Good luck. Cheers. Good luck. Cheers. Good luck. Good game. 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 Bernardo Silva plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And the starting 11 for Watford. Well, they're playing in a 4 5 1 formation, which is set up to counter attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And now they get the ball rolling. Moving into the advanced position. Grealish. Here's Bernardo Silva. Sterling! And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Bernardo Silva Jack Grealish Foden he has time to play it over Foden and now Sterling it's there for him and they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Ball's gone. Walker. Possession given away, unfortunately. And I'll be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Rodri. Phil Foden now. Beautiful pass. Good pick out a teammate. He does have pressure to deal with. And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, how close was that? Inches away.
De Bruyne. Sterling. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And a long way out here. And you've got to say, meat and drink to those in the wall. Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Kiko Femenia. Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so and have been threatening with it. Surely it's only a matter of time before they get another. And the attack looks promising. Emmanuel Dennis. King. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Rodri Sterling Bernardo Silva and Sterling has it sends it back De Bruyne oh a vital piece of last ditch defending Emmanuel Dennis running with the ball confidently of excitement level again no wonder they're excited well here it is again and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post but on this occasion although it's a good strike he should do better So underway again here on the back of that leveller. And it crossed the byline, a goal kick as a result. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days... Not at all, Stuart. Yeah, their passing hasn't been great, but he just hasn't done enough to receive the ball in dangerous areas. He needs to be doing more in and around that penalty box. Silva. Phil Foden now. Rodri. Foden. Bernardo Silva. This attack looks highly promising. Teammate and support. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, as you can see here, the build-up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal.
goes for Manchester City. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. He made it look simple, really. Bernardo Silva. It's with Joao Cancelo. Well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them. De Bruyne, Rodri, Phil Foden now, Kevin De Bruyne, and Bernardo Silva has it, nicely timed tackle, Rodri, Foden. Sterling has it. Bernardo Silva. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Sizoko. Imran Lusa. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Silva Rodri Joao Cancelo It's a promising City move Foden And now Sterling Oh and it goes Now he has his hat-trick A special moment for him Well, look at the finish here. He's just eased that beyond the keeper. That's a good goal, you have to say. And time for the change now. with the action and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment King terrific block and they've won the ball back following that challenge well City as the stats highlight have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Now can they make something happen? Losing possession here. Ismail Assar. Take it away. Grealish. It's with Joao Cancelo. Foden. De Bruyne. Really a very poor ball. And breaking at pace with Menace. Femenia. Might be able to get in behind the defence. The outcome is a goal kick here.
Grealish. Well, no two ways about it, Stuart. City absolutely cruising to victory today. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. And disappointing for the players on the centre that it didn't reach them. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Edo Kayembe. They've regained possession. And there's the final whistle. It goes into the books as a City victory. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Not a good night's work for Raheem Sterling. What in particular did you see from Sterling in this game? Well, he fully deserves the match ball. He was outstanding today, both with his skill and movement. What a performance that was.